Hi guys, Charlie from EV Powered here. Today is Friday the 23rd of July, which means it marks the start of the Formula E London e Prix weekend. And I'm gonna be going down and documenting everything that's taken place across the weekend. I'll also be one of Nissan Edam's VIP guests on the Saturday. So hopefully we'll be able to get a bit of a behind the scenes access there and show you everything that's going on. It's about one o'clock in the afternoon at the minute. So I'm just about to pack my things up and then it's off to the train station, getting the train down to London where I'll have my my PCR test just to make sure I'm all COVID secure for the weekend. From there, it's straight to the hotel to isolate just to make sure everything's fine for the Saturday where hopefully all the fun begins. This video will hopefully be the first in a series of vlogs taking you across all the different Formula E races. Obviously, we've got Berlin next month for the series finale and then it's looking ahead to next year's calendar an amazing calendar the biggest yet in Formula E so hopefully we'll be able to bring you some behind the scenes access to all of those um, but first it's London it's taking place this weekend and this is what you've got to look forward to So in the hotel room now, just been and done my PCR test and that's all good, all negative. So we're good to go for tomorrow and just got to spend the night in the hotel room isolating just so that we're all safe and sound for tomorrow. A lot of traveling today, a lot of train journeys, a lot of tube journeys, but I've been managing to keep my eye across free practice one. It looks like a lot of the guys were quick out there, not a lot between some of them. Good to see that Sam Bird was up there as well as one of the fastest. Hopefully he can uh, get some points on the board and extend his lead at the top of the championship. Seemed like the, the guys from Nissan struggled a little bit today, but uh, still a lot of driving and a lot of racing to go, so uh, a lot can happen. But uh, yeah, looking forward to tomorrow. Hopefully we'll be able to bring you some uh, cool behind the scenes content. Uh, so yeah, looking forward to it. Right, so it's race day. London Epre is finally here. It's going to be kicking off in just under a few hours time. Uh, just getting ready, going down to have some breakfast and then it's off to the Bottom Ocean Club with Nissan. But just first of all, take a look at this weather. It's already raining. It's already looking uh, a bit miserable and I think it's going to be that way for the weekend, which should be interesting obviously going from outside where it's wet into the indoor track which is obviously going to get wetter as the race goes on as the weekend goes on so should be interesting should be uh, a good weekend of racing but uh yeah we'll be bringing you some behind the scenes footage hopefully from the pit lanes and um yeah some some bits like that so looking forward to it and uh, we'll see you soon
So just got back to the hotel and honestly, what an amazing day. A massive thank you to Nissan Edams for the hospitality and a massive well done as well to Jake Dennis. It was an amazing drive from start to finish and to witness it firsthand uh, was really special, especially in Formula E's return to London after five years. I've only just found out as well that uh, the two Nissan Edams drivers, Sebastian Buemi and Ollie Rowland, have been disqualified for an overuse of energy, which is quite disappointing. It seems like they've picked up some, some decent uh, points, but uh, as with the nature of Formula E, they get to have another go at it tomorrow, so I'm sure it's going to be just as exciting, just as action-packed, and uh, yeah, can't wait for it. Morning everybody, Sunday, it's day two of the London e Prix in round 13 of the ABB FIA World Championship. Just at the hotel, about to leave, make my way down to the XL Arena again. Just looking at the weather, it does look slightly overcast but no rain at the minute. But we are forecast some so that's going to make it a little bit interesting and uh, hopefully more of the same of yesterday. Loads of action, loads of drama and just some great racing. So once again, we'll be bringing you some more behind the scenes content. Uh, we're in the grandstands this time. So a different take on the race, a different view and uh, yeah, looking forward to it. for our London e Prix blog. It was an amazing weekend, an amazing couple of days of racing, especially on the Sunday. It was a race that had absolutely everything and a massive well done to Alex Lynn uh, for his first win in Formula E and a big well done as well to Jake Dennis. It's off to Berlin next for the season finale. We'll be there documenting everything and hopefully bringing you a bit more behind the scenes footage like in this video. If you enjoyed this video, then please do remember to drop us a like and remember to subscribe as well. You can also check out all our other videos such as electric car reviews as well by clicking on our channel. Uh, but for now, thanks again for watching and we'll see you on the next video.